Hey everyone, Ryan with Geek here, and in this video, we're going to start a new project. And this is just a quick introductory video um, because I don't have a lot of time today, so uh, I doubt that I'm going to start constructing this. However, today we have this. And what is it you say? Well, let me show you, let me open it up and show you. This is a QRPGuys.com Power SWR Dummy Load. And so uh, it's a nice little digital um, SWR meter and it runs off of a coin cell, a uh, 2030 CR2032, which I happen to have several of. And let's we'll just take a quick look at the contents. By the way, if, if, uh, if you need a CR2032, 2032 don't go to your local store and buy one go to amazon i'll put a link below it because it's actually a, a thing you should know um, and you could buy like a pack of five of them there for a few dollars instead of paying four dollars for one at you know the local megalo mart or whatever um anyway but that's not the point of me showing you this um there are not a lot of components to this i mean there's several resistors obviously some capacitors there's these power resistors that clearly go there um, that's easy and a couple of diodes and a button and I'm guessing all these resistors resistors go here just guessing anyway uh, who knows but we'll we'll, um, we'll explore this as we go but uh, a couple of BNC connectors um, or SMA connectors that's a possibility too that's kind of cool they put that on there so anyway uh, that's the that so this kit costs $25 and uh, it was just released this year actually. And I went ahead and uh, I purchased one for portable use. Um, so that's why I got this because I would like to go portable. Um, I actually live near with, I mean, within short driving distance, maybe 15, 20 minutes, 30 minutes max of some uh, parks for parks on the air. Um, I've recently become interested in parks on the air. So, um, this will facilitate that with my QDX, with my BIDX, or with whatever I decide to take. Um, who knows what, what will come out. So I've also got, I've got several options for portable operations. Uh, I've got my QCX Mini, I've got the QDX, which is actually smaller. Um, I've got my micro BIDX, and if I ever finish my multiband BIDX, I'll have that. <laughs> so, um, but I'll definitely need an SWR uh, get, uh, meter because um, my, my goal for, my goal is to, um, uh, be able to use this. So I might even build this into an SW or into a, an antenna tuner. So this might get rebuilt. We'll see. Anyway, uh, and if you're not familiar with this, uh, I'll put a link to my blog below. This is a, uh, um, uh, a standard LC, um, uh, L match tuner. So we've got inductors here and a, an air variable capacitor here. A little bit big uh, for, you know, like backpacking or something, but perfectly serviceable for just portable, um, you know, go driving to a park and setting up on a bench or something. So that's what we're at. Um, if you have any questions about this kit below, uh, just let me know in the, in the comments down here and I'll be glad to answer them and do my best. And I think that's about it. That's all she wrote. Let's try to get my lighting good here. I think that's better. Yeah. So um, thank you for watching. And uh, if you're interested in following along with this build and testing it, then by all means, subscribe and you'll get notifications. Thanks a lot.